Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to generate custom item IDs in monday.com completely free. Um, it's really easy to do, I'm going to take you through it step by step, so I hope you find this video helpful. Um, so I'm in monday.com right now as you can see, and I've got my board here, and these are the item IDs that are provided by monday.com by default. And as you can tell, these aren't very user friendly, they're difficult to communicate with others, they're not very intuitive, um, and, and they mean absolutely nothing, it's just a random series of digits. The, our goal, and what we're going to do by the end of this video, is create custom IDs similar to this, they can be in literally any format you want, um, and they uh, really easy to set up, and they're going to be exactly like this. So, what we're going to do, first of all, is we're going to install this monday.com app custom item id generator i'm going to leave the link to it um, in the description top line of the description just go to the link and then click this button here sign in to install it should take you to monday.com um, and then as you can see we have the app here and i'm just going to click use app so select your workspace and then select your board so i'm going to do it on demo board and then click add app so it's going to set it up and install it and then we have it installed now. Now we just need to use a template. So uh, we only have one template here, so it makes it easy. Just click use template for the template provided. Okay, so now this is where we specify um, the details for our ID format and where it's gonna go. So as you can see, when an item is created, generate a custom ID with this prefix. So um, this can be any prefix. So for example, in what we saw here with task-1, uh, task-2, task-3, the prefix here is task-. dash. So if I wanted that, I would just do task-. dash. Um, it can be anything. You, you can literally just write whatever you want, and then it's going to be followed by um, a number. So I'm going to just do that, task-, dash, and then uh, prefix followed by an auto-incrementing number, and put the value in and then we want to uh, specify where we want the value to go, our um, ID column. So uh, ID, if you need to create a new column, just create a new column as you normally would or do it here. So once we've done that, we can now click add to board. So that's it. That's literally all you have to do. Um, it took us, what, two minutes and now it's all set up. So let's see it in action. Um, if I do new task, um, it's going to generate it. Obviously, I wrote these ones in manually just to kind of show you how it works. Um, this one that we're going to get generated is basically going to um, start at one again. So um, cause these are just text. These aren't related to the automation. So if I do another and another, as you can see, we have all of our item IDs generating. We have task one, task two, task three, task four. Um, and these are all automatically generated for us. So that's really how easy it is. Again, I'm going to leave a custom item ID generator at the top of the description for you to install. Um, I really hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching.